Hello my guys, welcome to another episode. This episode is an installation for the 2021 Toyota RAV4. Okay guys, so I got a friend, uh, he stopped by yesterday and we did some installations on his RAV4. A lot of stuff that we did before, so we don't need to show that. But uh, he dropped his stock wheels for free. Uh, I was thinking on those wheels uh, because it's the same as these ones. Um, it doesn't make any sense to have the same wheels and put tires and just have them as a spare. What I was thinking for those wheels, uh, probably I'm going to do the five lock conversion on my Accord. Uh, sitting over there, chilling. Probably going to do the five lock conversion because I think it's the same ball pattern. Five by 114.3. And sorry about the nails, but my daughter got my nails done this morning. So... 5 by 114.3 is, I think, is the same ball pattern than the 5 lock accord. So, probably we're gonna do a swap, do the 5 lock conversion on my accord, and get those wheels on because my wheels that I have right now they're crap and I don't have the money to buy new wheels right now. So, probably we're gonna use those. But for this episode, he dropped these crossbars for the RAV4 and I was checking those crossbars yesterday. I think they look better than OEM. And my OEM ones, uh, they're sold, so they're gone. I don't have crossbars and what I was thinking on putting those on, I was checking them yesterday and I think, uh, to be honest, they look a lot better than the OEM and let me show you why. In this episode, we're not going to worry much about the installation because we did that before. Uh, we're going to put the episode right here when uh, we did the review in some other um, crossbars for another brand. Those that we did before, they're cheaper, so I think this is a better quality. Let me show you. What got my attention on these ones, it was one thing, and it's right here. You can lock these ones up, and uh, the construction looks a lot better than the other one that we reviewed before. So this one is going to be the maximum load of 260 pounds, total 130 pounds per crossbar. So you have 130 on the back, 130 on the front, 260. Packaging a lot better than the other one. This is the gaskets to avoid leaks. All the hardware, I believe this is the instructions and the keys. So overall quality is a lot better on this one, I believe. And the material too. The material looks better than the other ones that we reviewed before. Even on the OEM that I get uh, on the on this 2021 RAV4, these ones look, for some reason, looks a lot better. Uh, at the same time, because I sold mine, I really don't use them. I feel like I don't want to put them on and, and sell them. But my friend told me, you know, just do whatever you want with them. And in this case, we're going to put them on and um, we might keep it. But like I said, I can get more money if I sell them without using them. But we're going to use them. We're going to put them on. Uh, and like I said, installation is pretty much like what I did on the reviews. So I'm not going to show you that part. We're just going to put them on and I'm going to show you how they look. When you're doing this, you have to put the small screw with the small washer. And don't get them tied all the way because you got to put them on your wrap for and uh, move them around. So that's why just... Uh, put them but not too tight so you can move them around and when you put them on and you get them right then you're gonna tighten them up with a small allen key and those are the big bolts they're gonna have this uh, locking washer put them on those and the key that's all you need to do what I like about these ones too is the quality of the gaskets and everything is labeled you just gotta follow and match all the letters right here with those so you can put them on your RAV4 with the gasket. For the installation, uh, you have the lock and unlock picture right there. You have to put the key to be able to remove the cover so you can put the bolt through and lock it in place. So you put the key, put it on the unlock position 
and remove the cover. Pull it from the back. Okay guys, we have them on. I think they look really good. Fitment is okay. Um, like I said, these ones, they look better than the ones that I reviewed before. Um, because of that luck, uh, I think they're better than OEM. To be honest, because on the OEM is plastic. They can just remove them right away, really easy. On these ones probably, they, they can install them too, but anyways, uh, probably with the luck, they're gonna have a little bit more hard time on removing them. The reason why those wheels are trash already. So I think they're gonna clear the Acura RL calipers. So, because those are 17s, these ones are 17s, and uh, I have enough space. And I have, I think it's a, what, 12 or 15 millimeter spacer just to clear the front of the spokes so we're good on that okay guys so i'll leave you with that if you want to see the conversion on the honda core from four uh, lug nuts to five stay tuned for that and if you want to see it quicker uh, go to the description buy some merch i have some bullet solano uh, shirts that i can sell so i can speed up the process you know so if you want to see it let me know and also if you want to support the five lug conversion I have my PayPal in the description. I don't like to ask for money, but uh, sometimes uh, with my back problems and everything that goes around right now, it's really tough to bring episodes like before. So, but probably we're gonna have some good news uh, in the next month or two. Uh, probably we're gonna finish with the back problem and the legal problems. So if that happens, uh, we're gonna have a new car, probably two more cars in the channel. So something good and something big is coming. I just need to wait a little bit more. Okay guys, so I'll leave you with that. Link is gonna be in the description for these crossbars. The company name I think is Autecoma. Uh, but anyways, the link is gonna be in the description if you wanna get these crossbars, because I think they're really good. I hope you like this episode guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and share these episodes. See you in the next one.